Welcome to Travel Discovery. I am Lisa and I will be your host. Today we are in California in the San Francisco Bay Area visiting Alcatraz, which can be seen from a distance. Alcatraz is San Francisco's notorious ex-federal prison. It's converted from a military installation to a federal prison in 1934. Alcatraz is one of America's foremost notorious ex-prisons. There's no fee for actually visiting Alcatraz Island, but the ferry companies that will transport you across the bay do charge for their services. Despite the fact that it was only used as a prison for 29 years, it's probably the most famous. There are two main reasons for this being well known. First, because of the notability of a famous prisoner, Al Capone. Second, its image that was recorded by Hollywood's movie makers. By current standards, the prison wasn't large, housing only 250 inmates, but because of its island location, there were never any escapes recorded from it. Thus, this added to the fuel for entertainment to create movies such as Escape from Alcatraz, where real life escape attempts were transposed into movies for the big screen. The TV show Myth Busters have since proved that escape was in fact a possibility despite Alcatraz's reputation to the contrary. Today, Alcatraz, known as The Rock, is overseen by the National Park Service who have representatives on the island. Visitors will be able to ask staff any questions they have, but there are no formal tours around the prison. There are self-guided tours. The evening ferry ride out to Alcatraz offers a greater insight into the island than the daytime ones as it circles the island and has a narration about the island's history. This should be balanced against the fact that there are some areas of the island that are not open at night because of safety issues. So whether you're interested in Alcatraz because of the myth, the celebrity inmates, the movie locations, or just the history, Alcatraz is an interesting way to spend a few hours. See you next time.